Hello guys, I got the Ryobi 40 boat lithium and Brussels weed eater 15 inch. Uh, thing's pretty nice. Um, you got three different string options uh, bump feed, serrated blades, and a fixed line. I got, I'm using a bump feed right now on the battery, just like on the lawnmower. You hit this button right here, and lights up how battery, how much battery you have left. I got 50% battery. I've used it three times. My whole yard is roughly 6,300 square feet. Uh, that's front and back. I've used it three times, and I have not charged my battery yet, so that's that's pretty good. I got some flower beds to weed in here around that and mailbox. And uh, you know, the best part about this is. Is you don't have to mix gas and oil, pull a rope a hundred times, and all that mess you do with the gas weed eater. So, uh, just give you battery charge and you're good to go. Uh, pick it up, it's not it's not very light. That's that's the worst part about it. It does get a little heavy, but if you don't have to, if you don't have a whole lot to weed eat, I mean, no big deal. But just pull this button here. This thing has a lot more power than I thought it would for battery powered. And uh, I've always used gas lawnmowers and gas weed eaters, blowers and all that. And the Ryobi is priced pretty good. It's pretty cheap. And if you're just doing it for home use, not, you know, doing it as a business, it has good products. You know, it has the beautiful green and black. And, uh... It has a uh, two speeds on it, just high and low right here. And I haven't used it on a low yet. Let's see what it does. I'm not sure of the difference, but uh, it's a good weed eater. Weed eater. It's pretty simple to assemble. Once you get it in, you put your handle on up here. You slide this in. It snaps. You twist this lock. It's really easy to do. And you add this onto it. Add just a screw right here that you have a screwdriver and tighten it down or a socket. I believe it's a 7 8 I mean, 7 16 I'm sorry about that. And uh, you can turn to the edger also by unlocking this, pushing this down, and twisting it. Which uh, I used it as an edger once, but the other day on Marketplace, I picked up. This 18 volt edger made by Roby, and I'll do another video on it. It's a pretty good deal. I picked it up for 20 bucks. It didn't have a battery, but I have the batteries for a drill that fit it. Also, here's the other deal: the Roby uh, lawnmower self-propelled that I use is the same battery as this right here. Okay, the lawnmower comes with one battery and a place to store a second battery on the lawnmower itself. And the battery alone is $159. But you can go to Home Depot and buy the Israel Obi weed eater for $179. And then there you go. You got a second battery right there plus a weed eater. You know, just for a little bit more. And, uh,. You know, if you get to charge your lawnmower battery like I just happened to do uh, the other day when I mowed, you can use this. Which, it takes about 50% battery on my lawnmower to mow the whole front and backyard also. So i got plenty of battery right now to mow my yard. And uh, I do have the lawnmower battery plugged in right now. I never timed how long it takes to charge. But uh, imagine a couple hours for a full charge but anyway uh that's just my opinion on this weed eater i love it so far my third time to use it and uh i, I recommend it and uh check out my other videos i'm trying to make more videos about tools and just just random modules but uh my next one is going to be the browby edger
18 volt. So, I appreciate you watching. Thanks.